Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Autos. In this video, I will show you how to sync Obsidian with Google Drive. So this is going to be a backup tutorial. But before we start, hurry up and check out our latest software just under this video. So let's get started. So you might be wondering how do you actually use Google Drive as a backup for Obsidian? Well, it's actually pretty easy, but there's going to be a few things that you need to do here for you to use Google Drive for Obsidian. Now, first thing you need to do here is you need to install the official Google Drive application for PC. So it's actually pretty easy. Go to their website here, which is going to be google.com slash drive slash download, or you could just basically just type in Google Drive download on Google and you should be able to see this link here. Now in this case, just click on download drive for desktop. This is going to be free. And from here, once you download it, go ahead and open it up and install it into your PC. Now in this case, just follow the on-screen steps on how to install a Google Drive there. And once installed, you just need to log in. Now you'll know that you're successful in installing Google Drive here once you go to File Explorer here and usually you'll be able to see a Google Drive icon under the This PC section as well. Also under Quick Access, Google Drive will also be added in there. Now in this case, once you've done that, you could go ahead and click on Google Drive here, click on My Drive, and from here, what we need to do is we need to add a new folder. So in this case, just right click on this area here, click on the new section and go to folder. And from here, you just need to type in the following, which is going to be obsidian. And from here, you could go ahead and just leave it as is. Now, in this case, the next thing that we want to do is we need to switch over to obsidian next. So in this case, go ahead and open up CDN here and we want to start using it. Now, in this case, there's going to be three options here that you could choose. You have create new vault, open folder as vault or open vault from Obsidian Sync. Now, in this case, since we want to use Google Drive here, click on the open section for open folder as vault. So let's go ahead and click on open. And from here, you need to look for Google Drives. So in this case, go ahead and look for the Google Drive option. So let's go ahead and click on it. You need to go to my drive here and look for the Obsidian folder that we just recently created. And from here, click on it and click on select folder. Now, once you've done that, you should be able to create this folder here for Obsidian. Now, in this case, whenever you actually create new or uh, add new something here, like for example, we want to add this one. So maybe I want to say there's going to be a testing note here and we want to say hi or hey in this section here. We also want to add a new section here for untitled. So maybe we want to view this one in Google Drive as well. Just to prove you that this being sync, we could go ahead and go back into Google Drive here and let's go to the Obsidian folder. And as you can see, testing note and untitled is now added in this section here as well. Now to give you an idea again, let's just add a new note here. And from here, maybe you wanna say this going to be hey, and from here, let's just go back into our folder and the hey.md file has been added in here. Now, in this case, if you want to re-access this specific Obsidian node here in Google Drive, you just need to do the same thing on your uh, PC. Just locate that folder in your Google Drive section here and you should be able to open it up. Now, just to give you an idea again, let's just go ahead and go to google.com here. So let's just go to google.com here. And from here, let's just click on the tree, the dotted icon here. And we want to go ahead and go to drive here just to see that if things actually synced up. Now, in this case, there's going to be a few things that we could view here. So let's just look for the folder section here. Go to Obsidian. And as you can see, the files are currently synced on my Google Drive. But yeah, so it's actually pretty easy. You just need to uh, have the correct tools here and a proper way to connect your Obsidian with Google Drive. And that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.